On June 21st, the 1,000th test shot of the SCAT gun was conducted, reaching a milestone for soft recovery. The projectile was assembled by placing the body on a vise and inserting a forward stop, a spacer, and then the test articles. The onboard recorder is weighed, then the last to go in before the base is screwed on, then torqued down to the proper setting. The round gets rotated and the nose gets screwed on and then torqued down. This keeps the payload from shifting during its launch. It is weighed and measured before it is brought to the gun. The projectile gets placed in the chamber and rammed to the proper seating depth by using a rammer. The propelling charge goes into the chamber, followed by two M11 gauges that will measure the chamber pressure. The breech gets closed and locked into place, after which the electric firing mechanism gets slid into place. Everyone leaves the gun area and the gun is fired. The projectile travels down the catch tubes and transfers its momentum to a piston that forces water out of the end of the tube where the projectile comes to rest in one of the three brakes, then it is brought back to the bunker for evaluation.